Hey, what's up you guys? Putting a trailer hitch on your Hyundai Santa Fe can take it to some really cool places, whether it be through bike riding, camping, or even towing a U-Haul trailer through most of North America. So let's go ahead and break down that really easy install. You'll need the tools seen here to complete your installation. To start, we're gonna need to lower our spare tire. Our spare tire kit is located in the cargo area, area right back here, and we'll go ahead and lower that. All right, next we're going to remove this underbody panel on the driver's side. We're gonna start by removing these three push pins using a flathead screwdriver. Next, we're gonna remove these two plastic nuts on the inside. We're gonna use a 14 millimeter socket. And these plastic nuts are attached to the underbody panel. So as we're loosening it, we'll need to pull down on the panel to help it come out. Now on the passenger side, we're gonna to need to lower our exhaust. It's being held in by three rubber hangers. There's one up front here, one back here by the tire, and one a little further up here. And we'll use some soapy water to help ease the removal. And then we'll use our exhaust removal pliers. Before we remove the last rubber hanger, we're gonna go ahead and support it with a support strap. We're just gonna loop it through this cross member right here. Now on the driver's side frame rail, we're gonna go ahead and remove this plug right here from the frame. And on the driver's side, we'll be using these two holes up here. We have two carriage bolts, and we'll be using this weld nut on the bottom. And we'll repeat on the passenger side. And on the passenger side, we'll be using these two holes up here as well. And we'll also be using both the weld nuts on the bottom of the frame. All right, now we're ready to bring our hitch into position. We're gonna be using our U-Haul exclusive hitch jack. If you don't have a hitch jack, we do recommend that you get an extra set of hands as this can be a little heavy. So we're gonna to wanna to slide it over the exhaust. All right, now that we have the hitch all lined up, we're gonna bring our large carriage bolts in on the driver's side and we're gonna put those in place on the top. Then we're gonna take our included flange nuts. And then in our bottom bolt, we're gonna use our included bolt and conical tooth washer. And we're gonna to wanna to make sure that the teeth are facing up. Now on the passenger side, we'll install our two smaller carriage bolts up on the top of the frame. And then we'll install our flange nuts. And then at the bottom, we'll install our bolt and conical tooth washer. All 
Okay, now that we have all of our hardware into place, we're ready to tighten and torque all of our bolts according to the manufacturer's specification. We'll be using a 19 millimeter socket for our two carriage bolts on the driver's side, and for all the rest of our bolts, we'll be using a 17 millimeter socket. For this rear bolt, as you can see with our tab right here, it's hard to get the socket on. So we're gonna use a pry bar. And we're just gonna pry it out of the way just a bit. And that will give us enough room to slide it on. And we'll repeat on the passenger side. Now we're going to reinstall our exhaust. Now we're gonna reinstall our underbody panel on the driver's side. Now, if you're gonna be installing your trailer wiring harness, you can leave this off since our harness is located right behind this panel. Now we're gonna reinstall our spare tire. All right guys, we went ahead and pulled the vehicle down onto level ground to show you some important measurements for your hitch accessories. So this is a two inch receiver. From the pinhole to the edge of the bumper is four and a half inches. And from the ground to the top of the inside of the receiver is 13 inches. That will help you determine the length, rise, and drop for your hitch accessories. All right, guys, that wraps up our install. Thank you for watching our video. If you have any questions or need more information about this product, or if you'd like to schedule a hitch installation with a U-Haul hitch professional, you can visit your closest U-Haul hitch center or visit us online at uhaulhitches.com.